Hey guys, I wanted to do a review of Funboy floats today. They're pool floats because if you use Instagram, I know you've seen these because they're literally everywhere. They've done a brilliant, brilliant job of really promoting these and making them like the best uh, pool floats and making them really, really kind of like comfortable and super cute and really social. So a lot of them are designed to seat like two to four people, which is really fun if you're in the pool or if you're at the lake, you're not just floating around on your own. But because they kind of come with a higher price point for a pool float, that was a mouthful, I kind of wanted to review it and see if they were worth the money, if the quality matched up to that, you know, if I thought they were durable, how long they take to inflate, because these bad boys are quite big, right? Because most of them are seating, kind of fitting two to four people, especially their new cabana, which is epic, but it's like $400 because it seats four people, it has a big canopy, it has a drink holder in the middle. So, so cool. My husband nicks that one though because he was like, no, that's not going to fit in our pool and we don't go down to the lake enough to use it. But um, yesterday my husband and I were at the pool outside and we just kind of did a little demo for you to show you how long it takes to inflate and deflate. Don't worry, I didn't do it in real time. I sped it up but with the timer. So you can kind of see the process, how easy hard it was and how easy hard it was to put away because it is big, so it's not something you're gonna leave out every day, especially if you live somewhere windy like we do. We live in Vegas, and um, this thing would just take off and be in the neighbor's or the next neighbor's yard. So we wanted something that was easy. I say we. He wanted something because he knew he'd be the one inflating and deflating it. So he's the one who's gonna show you that. So I got him on camera, so he's super cute. Like, so I hope you enjoy that. There's kind of some, there was some sound issues because of, it was so windy. We actually had a thunderstorm in the middle of doing it. So I'm doing a lot of like music and then captions over. So if you have any questions, put them in the comments. So they say, this one in particular, it's the Barbie one. Obviously called the Barbie pink, super cute girly. And it seats two, it has two cup holders, has three handles. It comes with a rope so you can tether it. And that cute little canopy on the top, sun canopy, canopy. I said I don't want it to sound like the food you eat, but you know what I mean, the sun cover on it. It's removable and it ties on, it has four ties on the corners. So if you want shade or if you want full sun, you can do that. And we kind of did a little how to yesterday with that to show kind of how easy or hard it was to do. What else do you need to know? Oh, it's a family company, which I really, really like about this. They're based in Venice, California. So that's kind of cool about it. And they just have so, so many different designs. They started with just the floaties and they kind of expanded now to the paddling pools and the sprinklers. And they're just always super fun, right? They want to put the fun back into being in the pool. And these are also really great gifts. Or if you're going to a 4th of July party, actually today's the last day, I think, to order to get them in time for 4th of July. They have a massive 4th of July sale going on. So now's a really good time to stock up. They're selling out fast. This color already sold out, but they do have another color I'm gonna link. And I've also linked, so this is really important, you do need a pump. You can buy up um, by mouth, but you might be there a few hours or just pass out from lack of oxygen, but you're gonna want a pump to blow this up. They're super cheap, they're like $25 on Amazon. The reason I'm saying Amazon and not Funboys is because I would recommend getting one that has a car adapter. So if you're down at a lake or you're camping, you can just plug it into the car and the pump and then inflate it on the go because you're not gonna fit this in your car fully inflated. So that's a really, really good pump to get. And then it takes, I'm not gonna tell you how long it takes, it's gonna make you watch the video and see how long it takes to inflate and deflate. So um, let's go to the pool. Okay, I have had my eye on Funboy floats for ages and I finally bit the bullet because they were on sale. And of course I had to get the little Barbie one. It's supposed to be like this, little golf cart, I say little in loose terms because it actually seats two people and it was one of the smaller ones they had and with a cover on it because as you know me I like to be out of the sun but in the sun to let me have the shade on me so I've got my husband to kind of blow up for me this morning and see how long it takes so we can kind of review the process because it's supposed to take two minutes so let's see how it goes. So what's cool is this shade that goes over the top is removable. So if you want to sunbathe, just take it off. And if you want some coverage, pop it on. So we'll see how easy that is. I made that sound really easy, but I don't know if it is. So we'll try with that as well. So here's a pump that makes it so you don't die having to blow it up. It comes with three different nozzles. So I checked to find a nozzle that would fit into the port. And this one works and fits perfectly near an outdoor plug. So we're gonna stick this in here. It's giving me his timer as well so we can be all official and see how long it actually takes to blow up because one of the things about this is it's so big, you don't wanna leave it blown up all the time, especially if you live somewhere windy like we do, like Vegas or Chicago, anywhere like that where it's just gonna take off if you leave it out. So we wanted 
a float that we can easily pop up and down just for when we use it. Do I have any ready? Okay, start the timer. for our first time blowing it up. So I think that's pretty good for a giant float. Wasn't too painful, was it? No. Cool, and then we'll see how easy it is to put on the roof. Okay, so if you want Ooh. to use this fringe top, it does have the four ties on the corner, so basically you just tie it on. And it also comes with a rope as well, so that's gonna be if you need to tie the float to anything. And um, when you put the top on, obviously you wanna make sure this is really well inflated so it supports the weight of this. It's not that heavy, but it's heavy enough if it's not fully inflated to maybe cause some issues. You might find it easier, sorry, it's the first time doing this. We're figuring out tips as we go to do it from the inside because you can actually see what you're doing and then you haven't got all of this in the way. Oh, we're seeing how long and how fast it deflates. These ones on the top don't have any kind of valves. When you pull it, they just deflate like that, which is great. And then same with the other ones. seconds. All set, but the canopy and the car definitely aren't fitting back in the same box <laughs> afterwards. Okay, so now you've seen how long it takes to inflate and deflate. I really, really love this. I actually was really impressed with how quick it was to do. And my husband did say it was easy and hassle free. Once you've got that valve in each place, they just blow up so, so quickly. I think there was three or four entry points for the valve to blow it up, but dead easy to do. Um, and then really quick to pack up. And then the only thing it doesn't fit back in the box. So we put the canopy um, back in here and the rope and all the instructions. And then we just shoved this, the actual fl pool float in a trash bag. So and we'll just put it in the garage. So that's just really, really easy. I mean, it's good to keep the box, right? It's so, uh, just keeps the, cause the top is obviously white, it's gonna keep it cleaner than if it was in the trash bag. But that's about it really for the price. I was actually really impressed with the price for the quality, especially whilst it's on sale. It's really, really good deals right now, but I would pay full price for this. I didn't have a problem paying for this. Um, the four person one, would I buy in the future if I was going to the lake? Absolutely, I'm not gonna buy it now cause it won't fit in our pool. But yeah, this is awesome. I don't like being in, well, I love being outside in the sunshine, don't get me wrong, but I like to be in the shade just because I did way too much sunbathing in my 20s. So I try and keep like the full SPF, the giant hat, the sunglasses. So this is really, really helpful. Now I can actually spend time in the pool with every while and they can enjoy the sun and I'll just sit here and drink my cocktails. Really happy, not even need to get out the pool to get my cocktails because it has the cup holders. So yeah, they're really, really, really cool. And if my husband wants to join me on it, he can. He can be all snuggly and romantic it does fit too and it does take the weight of two people, no problem. What else, yeah, if you have any more questions, ask me them in the comments and I'll try and get them answered for you. I'm gonna link this, I'm gonna link all, the, well, not this one, because this one's sold out, but I'll, I will link this one actually, because in case it comes back in stock, you can probably set a back in stock alert, as well as some different colors and some other ones I think are really cool, as well as the pump, so you can get this blown up and taken down as quickly as possible. 
If you like this video, please give it a quick thumbs up. I really, really appreciate you all watching. I hope you found it helpful. And let me know if you buy them. Um, if you take pictures of them, tag me on Instagram, Glamour and Gains, so that I can share them on my stories as well and see kind of see how you got on with them. All right, thanks guys.